There it goes. Yay. Yay. English. HDR unavailable. I think it's fine the way it is for now. Subtitles on, subtitle backing off. Oh, here we go, chat. Get ready for the music. this cutscene. It's such a shame that that, fight, that boss that you just showed is such a pushover, but this game is still really good regardless. Settings, game, controller, display. So performance or visual, definitely performance. They have a film game option, motion blur. Disable that, thank God. Output device TV mono mix mode, dialogue boost mode. Lots of options. All right, Demon Souls server. Let's go body type B. I will be Dan. Not dab, Dan. Soldier. Temple Knight. Temple Knight starts with a halberd, right? Yes, uh, Tifa, Tifa, item discovery, poison weapon, my baby. <laughs> we'll go with the Prudential Ring.
Hmm, something about that hair doesn't work for me. There we go. There we go. Much better. Man, these characters look so much better. King Alant the Twelfth, by channeling the power of souls, brought unprecedented prosperity to his northern kingdom of Boletaria. That is, until the colorless deep fog swept across the land. Boletaria was cut off from the outside world, and those who dared penetrate the deep fog never returned. But Valifax of the royal twin fangs broke free from the fog and told the world of Boletaria's plight. That the old King Alant had roused the old one, the great beast below the Nexus, from its eternal slumber. And that a colorless fog had swept in, unleashing terrible demons. The demons hunt down men and claim their souls. Those who lose their souls lose also their minds. The mad attack the sane and chaos reigns. Valifax also spoke of the enticing power of the demon souls. Each time a demon claims a human soul, the demon's own soul is invigorated by the life force. And the power of a mature demon soul is beyond human imagination. The legend spread quickly. Mighty warriors lured by the possibilities braved the fissure to breach the accursed land. But none have returned. Pure of the twin fangs. Yet the silent chief. Saint Urbane. Skurva the Wanderer. The sixth Saint Astraea with her knight Gaal Vinland. And Sage Frake the Visionary. The colorless deep fog slowly creeps beyond Boletaria's borders. Humankind faces a slow and steady extinction. The deep fog will eventually swallow all lands near and far. But Boletaria has one final hope. A lone warrior who has braved the baneful fog. Oh, has the land found its savior? Or have the demons found a new slave? That's hopeful. Brave soul who fears not death. I shall guide you to the fissure. So that you may lull the old one back to slumber. Oh. That will not do. Nope. Um. Ah, wrong button. Nope, that will not do either. That's better. I'll keep my pants on. If you were to look at the original game and compare it to, like, it's such a night and day difference. Direction, hold to sprint.
guard. Yeah, I won't be using that. Um, Thank you. Um, God, it's so dark. Alright, wrong button. <laughs> I keep it hitting the potion button instead of attacking. So good. These env the environment looks just stunning. Just stunning. I can't believe this is Demon Souls. This is like the first PS3 game I played, and I fell in love with it. Oh, this looks amazing. Oh, even the light on that looks stunning. Crescent moon grass. Uh, use item, switch item. Crescent moon grass times three? I remember that, like, this game came out, and then it didn't sell all that well. It sold okay. And then they didn't want to make... I don't think that they wanted to make a sequel, but then, uh... <sighs> But, so they set off on their own to make Dark Souls. And then Dark Souls exploded. Way more than this game ever did. Even though it's very similar. They just refined a lot of stuff, though. Is ray tracing enabled? Um, I don't think so. I have the 60 FPS mode on. We'll look at the, um, the other mode in a second. Oh, whoops. So let's compare. We can turn on the other mode. Oh! Oh! Oh, never again. Oh my... Never. Ooh, vivid. So there's different uh, filters you can apply to the game to see like what you want. I think I'll turn that off though. Yeah, I think I threw up a little bit. That was duh. That felt lower than 30 FPS. I don't know. In Demon Souls, unlike Dark Souls, you don't like get Estus Flash. You have to farm healing herbs, which you can hold in, like tons of, but you have to farm them off creatures. You don't just get them automatically by uh, by uh, resting. Can't see my items. Well, I'll move myself over. There you go. Forgot I was in uh, Assassin's Creed mode. Wait. You can hear it through the wall. Touch Archstone. And instead of bonfires, there's Archstones in this. Which acts similar. Strong attack. Take that, sir. My God. Look at the detail in the environment. Like, I'm guessing a lot of you have not played Demon Souls. Demon Souls is great, but it looked like ass back in the day. And this is like just god tier better. 
the lighting on that fire and stuff is so cool. Oh god, not the knights. God, those things look scary now. They were scary in the original. Now they look even more scary. Terrifying. This gets me excited for um, Elden Ring when they get that one done. And whoever made this, I hope I remastered this. Maybe they're remastering this to practice making another Demon Souls. That would be awesome. With Talisman equipped, use Miracle. Crescent moon grass, thank you. Or maybe they'll remaster Bloodborne next. Why is the character panting so much? Because Halberd's heavy as fuck. I don't know if you ever held one, but they're heavy. I meant to bash against someone's armor and stab them. Getting lots of grass, which is good. I see you. I saw there was a loot up here. More half moon grass, that's the better grass. Unfortunately, Bloodborne seems to have a frame rate cap in it, even on the PS5, so it won't run higher than 30. Wait a minute. Is this the one? Yep. Oh my god. Get up fast enough, damn. That guy's stun locked. Damn. Oh, hi, baby. That side swipe. Yeah, I know. Soul of the damn. Lost withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. That loading time was one second. Soul of the Lost withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. So the world might be mended. Oh, it's glorious. This is the Nexus. It holds together the northern land of Volataria. 
hands not quit the Nexus, but the five archstones will guide thee to the outer lands. Hi, baby. Hi, baby. I'm trying to press away. You've died in Nexus and imprisoned your soul. You cannot escape the Nexus. Remember, captured human souls. You reclaim your corporeal body. Corporeal body. Hi. Well, you slipped through the fissure too, did you? You came for demon souls? Or to save this land and be remembered as a hero? <laughs> Hunting for demons? Try one of the arch stones. Now go. That is why you came, is it not? To this accursed Politaria. You came for demon souls? Or to save this land and be remembered as a hero? But it's all the same. You're just another prisoner of the Nexus. We're welcome here. As long as we keep slashing up demons. <laughs> <laughs> Hello there, sir. I'm Stockpile Thomas. When the Scourge came, I didn't know what hit me. When I came to, I found myself here in this Nexus. My wife and daughter fell victim to the demons. But I would be worthless in battle. At the very least, I hope to lend my assistance to you brave slayers of demons. I would be happy to lighten your load and look after any excess baggage. When the scourge came, I abandoned my wife and daughter and fled like a coward. Faces are little, but everything else is great. When I came to, I was in this nexus. I haven't dared venture outside these walls since. I wish I could do more, but... <laughs> I am um, way better than it was for sure. The world beyond these walls. Best of luck to you. Ah, uh, some traditions never die, like the ever, like the bunch of messages over here. Time for messaging. If you lack the required seat, your weapon will be useless. Using a weapon in both hands causes your strength to be enhanced by fifty percent. When a weapon's durability is low, its attack power decreases. All these messages over here. Those look really good, too. I the messages on the ground look fantastic. I've died two times. Let's meet at the danger zone. Uh, I don't need to talk to you yet. I will... Let's just go kill some stuff first. Gates of Balteria. Let's see how fast it loads. Damn fast. The giant archstone is not in the game still. They didn't remake it. They didn't make it new. Got snacks. He's hungry. If I remember correctly, there's some loot behind us. If all this place things were still in the same places. 
Yep, they are. Late moon grass, that's good stuff. Yeah, we'll, well, I think we'll play bug snacks next. Let's try that one out. At least try to beat uh, the blobby boss. Hello. Hello. Oh, no, you don't. Crescent moon grass. I'd assume they brought back world tendencies, too. So this... I think this opens when it's light tendency. Oh, man. This brings back so many memories. This is so good. I think I'll do Faith uh, Halberd build for this. I love my Halberds. Halberds are super good in this game. If you want to be super OP, just use magic. Magic is god tier powerful in this game. You can blow up a boss in seconds. Bloodstain. Gotcha. Pine resin. That is locked. Try fire. What? No. Oh, wait, that's where you go through the other side. Oh my god, I forgot about that. I'm at half health because of the way Demon Souls were. I completely forgot about that mechanic. When you're dead, you have half the health as when you're in human form. But if you die in human form in the world, you, you shift the world tendency towards dark, if I remember correctly. Something like that. Ow. Come here, boys. Yeah, so we're... See how we're glowing? We're in spirit form. And there's also human form. Where you get double the health, but... Every time you die, you shift the world tendency to... To dark. Where is world tendency? Yeah, there it is. See, the way this works is there is five art stones... And every time you die in a world, while in human form, it shifts to dark tendency. Certain areas and certain things are only available in pure dark and pure light. Every time you kill a boss, it goes up uh, to light tendency. So you kill a boss, it goes towards light. Something like that. So that's there's certain areas in the game that are only available while it's light tendency to uh, get certain items. It's a mechanic that was sounds cool on paper, but ah, no. that's not. Oh god! Oh god! That's just a cluster fuck. Okay, so fire apparently hurts. Gotcha. Big swinging weapon in the tight place. Not a, not of the best of ideas. But I love the halberd. It's my favorite weapon. Yeah, fire is hot. Fire bombs, cool. The inside parts are very very dark. Yes. You can adjust the brightness on your TV and stuff. Thank you. So 
so far the gameplay feels exactly the same. I don't think it, it doesn't feel any different. So I think they kept all the AI and the, the move sets and stuff. It all, that all feels exactly the same. It feels just like Demon Souls. So if you rely on muscle memory and stuff, it'll feel like that. Ow, back, ah, yep. Firebomb. Yeah, everything is exactly the same as in the base game. Whoops. The AI, the way the weapons swing and feel, all that feels exactly the same. They kept it all. Yeah, the enemy placements and ow. Whoa! The damn fire bombs. Got an infinite number of them. Hit me one more time with that firebomb. Get very upset with you. Yeah, the animations and stuff look smoother, like graphically, but you can tell the underneath part is the same. They kept all that to be faithful to the original. Whoop. I believe this is a weapon. Yep. It's a bastard sword. Yeah, the first boulder trap. Hi there, sir. This area is a pain in the ass. All right. Woo. You guys want to see one of the toughest enemies in the game? One that gives me nightmares even today. <laughs> there he is. <laughs> the Red Knight. With a halberd and a shield. <laughs> he will mess you up. Let me unlock the shortcut and stuff first before I go over there. There's a shortcut over here we can open before we go attack him. Blue Eye Knight's pretty tough too, but not nearly as bad as the Red Eye Knight. Half Moon Grass, nice. So dark inside. Hello there. More fire bombs. Those will be very useful on the first boss. Beware of barrels ahead. Yes. Oh my god, I, I forgot. I thought of something. If I can put it there. A good message. How do I leave messages? <laughs> Here it goes. Messages. Uh, warnings. Beware of. Trap. Let's 
see B. Advice. Beware the enemies. Rock. Doors, spice, projectiles, corrosion, demons. Was there a boulders one? Traps, rains, water, miracles, cages, doors, boulders. Beware the enemies, boulders. That's a good one. I know, I missed it. This is like, brrr. it was right there. When someone writes your message, I think you get healed or just fancy points, I guess, maybe. I don't know. A little partying never hurt anybody. <laughs> oh, they fell to their deaths. Great. Same AI. <laughs> Yeah, that hasn't changed at all. Oh, and I should write, there's a... There's another... Advice, um... You'll find a secret. You'll find a secret past here. Then put a try attacking. That way people, if you gotta attack those chains to get a uh, secret that falls down below. I'm trying to be a helpful player. Just like chat's always helpful to me. In an alternate reality. That wasn't the right. No. Ah! Oh. Ah! Gotta watch out. If one of those guys hit those barrels right there, it's all over. Shortcut time. Particle effects do look great. They did a great job with the aesthetic of this game. This should be an armor set. No, cling ring. And then the secrets right here. That's the armor set. Ragged robes. Jade hair ornament. Less HP reduction when in soul form. That one's actually very good. Now I forget what the, a plain jade hair ornament. I think that's for a quest. We'll turn that in a minute. Oh, look how much more health we have now since we have the cling ring on. What so ring will be wearing almost the whole game. Maybe 
very careful. It's easy to fall off the edge here and die. I don't think I could even dent the red, red eye knight just yet. Write a message. Uh, time, time for jumping. Jumping, fighting, rolling, kicking, falling down. Or was vaulting on there? Time for is vaulting on there? Breaks talking. There is vaulting. There. But not just yet. Back up. Give it a second. Gotcha. Clear out a little bit path before we go down there. I see you. Alright. Hello there. Good day to you. Care to look over my wares? Mostly stolen, but who's telling me? How are you? Brave knight or lowly fodder? The demons snatched their souls regardless of good. their station, plummeting them all into madness. And those who dare cling to their humanity were hunted down. It is the end of Great Boletaria as we know it. But hell, at least the demons don't send us to our deaths in battle. <laughs> he looks... They made him look even creepier than he did in the original. There's this skinny fellow clad in the most lavish armor who's always mumbling about some mission he's another one who's managed to stay sane like yourself probably some pampered little lordling by the looks of his attire <laughs> i'd give an arm just for the buttons off his shirt you know what he looks like he looks like me two weeks after cyberpunk releases i could stop playing any time no, I could, I could, I could stop. I'm fine. Back off. Go ahead. Take your time. I'm not going in. Back off. I don't have a problem. You have a problem. Should be a night around the corner here. I think it's down. Something's down that way. Oh, hi. Okay. Crescent grass. I love me the halberd. Whoa. Okay, run back. No, nope, that's wrong way. <laughs> I did not mean to fall down here. That was a whoopsie. I 
got to get I got to find my way up and then get out of here. Skimitar. Okay, someone else is coming. Hey. Demon Soul looks pretty cool. Um if you've never played it before, you can see all of the influence that they learn all of this the stuff they learned from when they made Dark Souls. Hey, buddy. My thanks for your brave rescue. I am Ostrava of Boletaria. Ostrava. Accept this as a token of my gratitude. <laughs> a, a brass telescope? What? Um, thanks? What the hell am I going to do with that? Now I take my leave. There is something I must do. Um, you're not going to steal my experience, are you? Is he getting attacked? I need him to stay alive. Ow. Accidentally hit him a little bit. Okay, I need him to stay alive. Don't let him die, please. I don't step on that. God. Okay. Woo. It seems like they slightly beefed him up, so he's got even more health than normal. Sharp stone and hard stone. Hell yeah. Those are for upgrading your weapons. Uh, guy in the corner there. Unknown hero soul. I need to go back and jump over to get that. Or it might be too late. I don't know if I can get it now. Because I fell down. Maybe I can? I don't know. If I hop over, maybe I can still can get it. Crescent moon grass. Ah, the, the sounds are very meaty when you connect to these weapons. Oh, getting attacked. Gotta hurry.
Yeah, I think they redid all the sound effects to make them chunkier and meaty. While still keeping the original feel. There, I think there's a knight, well, a knight up here on these stairs. Yes. Ow. Got him. And then one guy on my left. Ah, all right. Now I gotta figure out how the hell I got up here, and I gotta get back to the beginning to hop over that ledge and see if I can still get. I remember, there was an item up where that guy was standing. It was uh, this way. All right, I think it. Yep, it's right there. Thief ring. Hey, buddy. Yeah, Thief Ring, I think, lets you get closer before they realize you're there. Lowers enemy detection range. Yeah, we're getting close to being um, to the first boss. I think we're just... We're, this tower over here is how you get down to the first boss. I think it's in here. Actually, you know, we got a little bit, little bit more to go. After we do another stone trap. Oh, God! <laughs> well, that's one way to get through the trap there. <laughs> Okay, let's go ahead and uh, put a... Advice. Um... Time for normal attack. Wait, what? Shooting, blocking, rolling, yelling, healing, guarding, talking, vaulting. Well, shit. Um, maybe try. Try normal attack. There you go. I remember in uh, Dark Souls, people would make hilarious messages like, try finger, but hole. And other silly messages like that. Using the templates. <laughs> Amazing chest ahead. If I remember correctly, I think there be dragons. Hi. Beginner should go here first. Yep, let's um let's get the red one away from here first. Hi there. Hey 
Here she comes. Watch out. I can't wait to see what the new effect looks like. <laughs> okay, while she's over there, I'm gonna head back over here. Is she coming back? She better not. Purple flame shield. Whoa! <laughs> Run! Ah! <laughs> You're fine. Look forward to treasures. Archstone shard and full moon grass. I took a couple of her shinies and she didn't like that. Yeah, there's two dragons. Um, you're not meant to fight them here, but you can shoot them. I think if you have a bow and arrow, and you can kill them after like a bazillion shots. If you have like a thousand, couple, few thousand arrows, you can probably kill them slowly. <laughs> Grab it. all the loots in the same places. This is fine. Oh my god, it's terrifying. Yeah, we're playing in the 60 FPS mode. The, we tried the cinematic mode, it just looked awful. Oh god, that lighting in there. Got you, sir. Whew. Now we're gonna go fight the hardest boss in the game that almost no one is able to com com finish. The hardest boss in all of Dark Souls, Falnix. The lore in Demon Souls is that some sort of colorless fog is poisoning the land and the demons are inside of it. Killing humans and then sucking their souls. And after a demon kills a human and takes their soul, they go crazy and become like these guys. Some 
fine resin for this. Good they take forever to die. Hello. Let's get some pine resin. Ooh, sharpstone shard. That's awesome. And another one. Hearthstone shard. Tapping grass. All right, shortcut officially open. Alright, hardest boss in all of Dark Souls. Here we go. Hardest boss in all of Dark Souls. Now we're in human form. Thank you, chat. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. That, that one's for you guys. That was for you. And now, oh, lead demon soul. Now we can go back. And level up! Welcome back. Hello. Put some shoes on. The monumental awaits the above. I would like to level up, please. The monumental awaits the above. The monumental will explain the nexus to thee. Oh, you won't let me level up. All right, fine. Hmm. You new here? Are you here for my services? The name's Baldwin. I'm just an ordinary blacksmith. It's simple. Just bring me all the souls you can. In trade, I'll give you weapons. 
or forge the ones you already have. With your souls, I can eke out a living. And with my weapons, you can go on living. Not a bad deal, eh? He's just like this channel. Bald win. I get it. Let's upgrade our halberd to level two. And again. Never mind. I need two more pieces. Now I it's let's see. I need to see what the you scaling come back is. Alive. I need your business. This is Where do I see the information? There it is. Why? This has scaling. That's not me. Where do you find the scale? I forget where the scaling stuff is. Where do I click to see like what it? Each weapon has like a scaling factor, and I can't remember what it is. Halberds are like. Maybe it's in here? Oh, there it is. There it is. Okay. D and E. It's uh, strength and. It's got a little bit of strength, a little bit of dexterity, but not a ton on either. Okay, finally found it. Make sure you talk to this guy every time you come out of there. Still alive? I am impressed. This is something that might interest you. The black-robed maiden of the Nexus looks after the flames. She's the morose one, with eyes sealed, compacted by wax. She can control souls like no other. Bring her the souls of men and demons, and she will embolden your flesh and blood with their power. But beware, do not decay into a foul beast. I'll try not to. Yeah, her eyes are encased in wax. Now, there's something that we have to do every time we um, get into human form because we don't want to die in a level ever in human form. We just always want to do a little whoop. No. No. Because we want to constantly be in spirit form the entire playthrough so we don't shift the tendency of the world to dark. It's easy to make a world pure black, but making it white is, I, I don't think you can without killing bosses. This is the easiest way to do it. Yep, we did. Since we just killed that boss. Wait a minute, we're online, aren't we? Does online affect world tendency again? I can't remember. Mine has been mine needed to have been offline to do it properly. Wait, where are my souls? Moose the average of all players on the server. Well, that's really hard to get white tendency then. Write a 
message here. Right. Choose uh, a... Observations. I am a... Uh... I am a twinkly. <laughs> I am a twinkly. All the monumentals are dead. Except one. We have long awaited you, slayer of demons. I am one of the monumentals. We preserve the fabric of reality. There is a tale I wish to tell you. Once, we too were a scourge of demons faced. In the distant past, under benevolent rule, the world was united owing to the soul art. Until, a lust for power caused the awakening of the Old One. Across the land seeped a colorless, deep fog, and the world faced extinction at the hands of the demons. Thanks be, we were able to lull the Old One back to its slumber. Yet only after the loss of innumerable souls, and most of the world, lost, erased by the fog. In order to mend the fabric of what land still remained, we entrusted six leaders with six precious archstones. One to the king of a small yet industrious land. One to the king of the burrowers underground. One to the wise queen of the great ivory tower. One to the chieftain of lost and ill-fortuned souls. One to the shaman of the tempest-worshipping shadowman. And the last to the great giants of the northern lands. The archstones were placed in the fringelands that survived. We contained the Old One here, below the Nexus, and prohibited the Soul Arts. Finally, we became monumentals, half-living sentinels of the fabric of reality. Alas, the other monumentals have perished, and only I remain. By the power of the memento, four sealed art swords have been unlocked. Now it is your turn. You must lull the old one back to its slumber and seal it away for all eternity. If not, a deep fog will absorb all that we know. Have you the strength to bear this burden? No. Yes, I see. That is unfortunate. You should know that you will be imprisoned in the Nexus forever. Just like the poor Candle Maiden. <laughs> you must destroy the old. You must. Uh. No, I'm up for it. I was just kidding. I was just kidding. Can't take a joke. Ooh, there's loot in here. Stone of Imperial Eyes. This is super cool, though. They're all dead. 
They did such a good job redoing this. This, look at the light, my God. It's exciting. I, I just like imagining them making more Souls games again. And chat's favorite meme, Elden Ring. There is a way to fall here. Uh -oh. Yep. Ow. <laughs> Whoops. I thought maybe there'd be a secret right there, but no, apparently not. Just death. Mission failed successfully. Imagine I'd be the last hope of humanity and then I just slip and fall right there. <laughs> Then they'd be like, well, fuck, what now? By the, did, you, did you notice that loading time, by the way? Like, that was like... Seconds. Just a couple seconds of boop, reloaded. Why is that there? Just Jabate, I guess. What's up here? On the very, very top. Touch door to Pantheon. I. What is this? Valuable item ahead. Most most phantom saved. Oh, these were they like super crazy um Like these were always hacked like crazy on uh, PS3. Yeah, it's like a leaderboard type thing. Some of your eyes. Boom, 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 boom. Fastest first completion. Stop and pause. You can see see people. Most demons vanquished. Seventeen. Remember, I beat Flame Marker first try. Yeah, I beat like I think it was just about every boss first try on my first playthrough of this. We did it. It was a twenty-six hour stream in one sitting. That was back in 2000 and I want to say 11 or 12. It was a long time ago. It's all recorded. Actually, it was. I had to delete all the VODs, fortunately. Maybe it's out there somewhere still. Okay, I got to run the bathroom real fast. I'll be right back in a second. You guys can admire the beauty of the of this room. I got on the potty. And we're back. Now we can finally level up a little bit. And now this is where the real game begins. Brave soul for whom death is no fear. Pretty. Lull the old one back to its ancient slumber. Eye stones, brief connect diffuse world. Should you lose your physical form, remember the eye stone. Made in black, manipulates souls with inhuman prowess. Her strength allows her to aid slayers of demons. I 
Hold on one second. If I'm gonna get pure white tendency, I have to go on offline. I don't think I can do it with that if I'm online. I think I can still do it. If I'm gonna get pure white tendency, I'm gonna have to be offline for that to work. I don't know if you can get pure white uh, tendency if you're online in this game. Or did they change it? I don't, did, it did they change it at all so that way it's easier? Because if you're offline, when you beat all the bosses, it's pure white, and then you can get to the, the secret stuff. But um, I don't know. Can you, like, in the original, it was nearly impossible to ever get pure white soul in the, while you're online. I don't know if they changed it or not. Well, we can do it on a second. We'll do it on the second one. It'll be fine. I think we can go offline and do the Sultanancy on the second playthrough or something like that. Basically, uh, there are, there's this mechanic in Demon Souls, it's not in Dark Souls, where the Archstone, the Archstones can go have different tendencies, dark to light, um, and if it's pure white, certain areas in the levels open up which have items in there you can only get when it's pure white. Um, if you're online, everyone's average gets added together. If you die in human form, you it lowers it down, so people are constantly dying. It's it's near impossible to get pure white on online because of the average. But maybe they made it easier? I don't know. All right, let's level up. What is it? Seekest thou the power of souls? Yes. Seekest thou the power of souls? Of course. After all, thou requirest strength. Go ahead. Touch the demon inside me. Well, they... Let these vagabond souls become thine own. They literally never explain that mechanic in-game. You just have to know it. Soul of the mind, key to life's ether. Of the lost withdrawn from, from its, its vessel. vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might, might be wended. So the, the world, world might, might be mended. We definitely want endurance to be up super fast. Yes, yourself. I'm only here to tend to each flame. I keep the candles lit and serve the brave demon slayers who are trapped here. Yeah, all the lines are the same. I think they re recorded some of them, though. To get better uh, sound quality. Let's try the Dwarf Palace, I guess, next. It's been a while. I think they, they got all the voice actors they could back. <laughs> you look rough. <laughs> Hello there. Souls, souls. I trade fine goods for souls. Um, elixir, pickaxe, hardstone, edge sharpening stone. Our little town. <laughs> it's a nice wee place. All those lizard-eyed townsfolk are busy tinkering with stone and don't bother with old folk like me. Makes life rather easy for me. I can get away with anything. <laughs> I always knew there was a god. <laughs> Thanks for looking out for me. You want to play? You've got to. Alright, this is gonna be tough. Here we go. It's gonna be our first lizard.
wait a minute is it here I don't see it anywhere is it well let me try let me try something Exit and go back in. I think it respawns. It should be there. Might just have to respawn. I don't see the lizard anywhere. Wary of hidden foe. Alright, run, 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 run. Ow! Sticky white slime! Hell yeah! Who, who left that there, Jack? Don't give me the it's ectoplasm shit. I've heard that one before. Change that animation. <laughs> that was super awesome. Okay, hold on, sir. So good. These guys look so much better than they did in the original game. They were weird looking as hell. Crushing battle axe plus one. I forgot there's weapon durability in this game. I forgot to check if my weapon's getting damaged or not. Renowned warrior soul. The only thing I don't like is extreme weapon grading, uh, color grading. You can, they have a filter in the game where you can have a classic filter. I don't know what it looks like, but you can, I'll see what it looks like, the classic filter. Kind of washes everything out like the original game. They also have a vivid filter which enhances the colors. <laughs> no. They also have bright. Ah. Let's 
Summer, winter, evergreen, monochrome, antique. Some of those were like, what the fuck? Stone of Imperial Eyes. Hi there. <laughs> Nothing personal. In the original, these guys just look like blobby guys. Now they look like they have actual cool look to them. is some guys that have bags. They have some good loot in them for me to upgrade my weapon. Hello. The lighting is so dark in here. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to hit you, sir. Okay, e everyone, calm down, calm down. Whoa, everyone's on my ass right now. God, I'm running out of healing items. I forgot, you don't regenerate them, so you have to farm for them. Form a line. Okay, this guy should have some good loot for me. Yeah, there, in in this game there isn't Estus Flask. What you what you do instead is you farm these things called herbs. Kind of like um, remember how Bloodborne you had the blood vials? You didn't automatically get them back. In this one, you have to farm them um, if you run out. Just like Bloodborne. I got some half moon, but it's a little bit stronger. But I'm out of the, the cheap grass. Whoa, dogs! I've got dogs! Ah, what? I forgot about the dogs. Damn them. They hit hard. That's a bad doggy. Big 
very, very bad dog. Okay, as long as we don't attack these guys, they'll leave us alone. We'll see them. Just, uh... Oh god, dogs are back! Oh god. Oh, the double, the wombo combo. Uh, this is a remake of Demon Souls, which was the game that was the that came just before Dark Souls, which is the one most people know. barely see these damn dogs. No, I'm in spirit form, so I can die infinitely and not affect the world tendency. That's it. And then we have a Lappy. That... <laughs> Those fuckers with the whips. <laughs> Ow! God damn me, it's all... He stunned me. I couldn't roll away. It's hard. And I got whipped like a... I got whipped like a simp there. This was the hardest soul. It's, this game is very tough. Very tough. Well, at, it's been about two hours, so it's a good time to switch to the next game. Uh, I think next we'll try Bug Snacks. And we'll try that one. And see how that one is. Yeah, bug snacks. I've heard good ones things about that one. Talk about bug snacks. Alright, another launch title for PS5. Made by the people that made Octodad, I think? 